Your yeah, man, what is good? It's the kid, man, the HBK. Be long thug, man, the one and only. And yeah, the other jits, man, they be faking and baloney. You already know how we rocking. You already know what happened. We won. We got all the team. We predicted all the teams who was gonna play. The winners of all the team. And bro, I got the results, man. I think I did pretty straight, pretty good for week one. And we got week two coming up ahead. So you know we finna get that prediction video in Wednesday. We gonna do that tomorrow, man. Wednesday, man. We gonna have that out for y'all, man. But hey. We want to just talk about the results, man. Talk about the primetime teams, primetime games. And we're going to talk about the little results, man, on that Friday, man. That big game, that UNC versus VT game. Nobody expected that. I ain't even going to lie. I ain't expect that. I ain't expect Carolina to lose. Talk about Thursday, too. You got Ohio State and Minnesota. That was a straight game. Like, nobody expect Minnesota to come out and play that hard. Hey, my boysy boys lost in the tough one, even though they was up 21 points. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Them boys out there hitting, man. Them boys trying to call target on every hit they had like then i got the upset alert you feel me with i picked charlotte over Duke. And uh, hey, really, South Dakota was supposed to beat Kansas too, bro. But Kansas found a way to score at the end, bro, off a penalty. And M Michigan State looked straight. You know what I'm saying? I only picked Michigan State not to win because one of the transfers from Florida went there. And then on Saturday, bro, that big game against UGA and Clemson, no touchdowns from either one of these teams on offense. But Georgia figured out a way to pull out with the dub with the pick six. And that was a result of them winning the game, really, and their defense won the game for them. Hey, you could see them moving up in the rankings then you got oklahoma and tulane i don't know if, if oklahoma should be the number two team in the nation after that performance of course we know what alabama was gonna do i'm surprised that iowa state is number seven in the nation like i said and they almost lost to northern iowa which is really a basketball team you feel me then you had oregon and fresno we knew that was gonna be a high game but i thought oregon was gonna smash them boys turns out wrong fresno came out to play because they just came off a week one win then my my iowa boys man but I tell y'all, bro, don't play with no Hawkeyes, man. You know we finna have that little recap, review, like, you know what I'm saying? We finna have that little vid out for y'all, too. Finna do a reaction vid to that USC game, because I ain't even get to watch it. But as you can see, they got the dub. I don't know why I picked Temple to beat Rutgers when I got a Rutgers dynasty. That was lame of me. But I picked Temple because of Dwayne Mathis, and he was out there stinking it up. That boy was out there boo-booing his diaper, boy. Yeah, but I picked Central Michigan over Missouri. They almost came out with a dub, but they ended up losing shortly in the fourth quarter. Same thing with Rice. They was all, they was about to beat Arkansas, and Arkansas found a way to pull out with the dub. I don't know why I picked Ohio over Syracuse. Because them boys ain't even put up more than 10 points. My Purdue boys. Yes, sir, Ski. Them boys came out with the dub, too. It's going to be crazy to see if Purdue and Iowa play this year. I ain't trying to look at the schedules. I want to be reacting to the schedules as well. So, I ain't look at the schedule for y'all. And then, as you look ahead, you see Georgia Tech lost. I don't know why I picked Cal. Because they lost in Nevada. And the crazy one of all, too, you got Washington losing to Montana, bro. At least I called UCLA beating LSU. I already know that was going to happen. Them boys look tough out there. Chip Kelly got them boys turned. Motivated right now in that Pat 12. Let's see if they take it home. But I don't know if they're going to beat my SC boys. That's one thing about it. I'm all Oklahoma State boys pulled out the dub. Yeah, it was a little ugly, rocky got, um, performance. But that boys pull out the dub week one. Then you had your Sunday and Monday games. You got Florida State and Notre Dame. I picked Florida State. They almost came out with the dub. If they didn't have so much faith in their kicker, bro, they would have won the game. And Notre Dame had faith in their kicker. They won the game. Then you had a little bit of um, Ole Miss, and you already knew the result. Come on, bro. Ole Miss is going to smash them. Everybody knew this. But well, if you didn't know, you was a Louisville fan. We went overall 58 and 25 for all the picks on week one. So we got week two vid coming right up for y'all. And we finna get the ranking vids in too. You feel me? So, hey, y'all stay tuned, man. Y'all already know who it is, man. If you don't thug, I got you.